Thank you, Mr. Chairman, and thank you, Mr. Secretary. I'm delighted to hear of your continuing commitment to putting research dollars into carbon capture and uh, especially into using that carbon to enhance oil recovery because, of course, in North Dakota, any, any research that has as its ultimate goal extending the life of our coal mines and our Bakken oil patch is a, is a noble, noble goal indeed, so I thank you for that. I just hope that we can put enough research dollars into, uh, into DOE to keep up with the, uh, the rules at the EPA so we don't get the rule ahead of the research. Um, I want to ask you specifically, though, you referenced earlier a little bit uh, about efficiency, and I want to focus specifically on turbine efficiency and the role that might have in, in, uh, in producing, uh, well, putting us at a global advantage uh, for lots of things, not the least of which is, by the way, the manufacturing uh, sector and manufacturing the turbines that might get us another percent or two or three. And, and with gas becoming more and more important and more and more important fuel, for generating electricity, I'd like you to, to uh, speak specifically, if you would, to research that enhances gas efficiency for, for generating electricity. Um, certainly. By the way, I might add, um, going back to the, your yes. prologue, uh, <laughs> of course, with the Great Plains uh, plant, yes. um, I think they've now passed 20 megatons of CO2 um, uh, for enhanced oil recovery in the Weyburn field. So it's quite a, That's true. Quite, a large, no, quite a large amount over the last 10 years or so. Yes. Um, on turbine efficiency, the, uh, the department uh, really, going back to the 90s, had a very, very major program on increased turbine efficiency uh, that was done with, uh, uh, I think the main programs were with GE and with Siemens, uh, leading both of them to uh, now commercialize uh, the, um, I think it's called the F, F turbine series, I think it is. Uh, and, and so those were a substantial uh, jump in efficiency. Uh, they, I think, are now getting into the marketplace uh, and it's very impressive. Uh, uh, certainly in combined cycle plants now, I think you're talking over 60% kind of, kind of, kinds of efficiency. So it's a, it's, it's a, it's a big deal. Uh, well, if we can squeeze another percent or two and get into the you know, low 60s, I think it, my understanding is it could make quite a massive difference. Uh, yeah, no, uh, percents here and there matter. <laughs> yeah, they sure do. Right. Uh, I want to focus on something a little different now. A couple of years ago, I think two years ago this month actually, the administration or the president actually signed an executive order forming the interagency working group on research for hydraulic fracturing. And at the time, uh, it was announced that there would be a research plan developed by the agencies that include, of course, the Department of Energy, EPA, I believe the um, um, Geological Survey is a part of that. Um, it was going to be presented to Congress in January. Uh, January came and went uh, last year. Uh, January has come and gone this year. We're now into uh, the blossom season here in Washington, D.C. I'm just wondering if you could give us some idea of when we'll see that plan. Um, Okay, I, I, will, I, will, I will certainly look into that right after the, the, the hearing. Uh, there is a very active group uh, with uh, DOE involved in these unconventional gas uh, uh, technologies. Um, I certainly have seen uh, a research agenda uh, there, so um, let me just look into that and see if we can well, get I, something I, I to know, I think the promise was that we would the Congress would be presented with a research plan from the uh, working group. We've not seen that. No, uh, I, I hear you. Years, so I hear I'd you. Like so, to... so let me let me let me look into that. Okay, we'll look yes. forward to it. because there, there certainly is a a an R a sort of a, you know an R and D agenda that I that I have sure. seen uh, there. Well, I, I appreciate that, and uh, Mr. Chairman, uh, I yield back the balance of my time. Thank okay. you. Uh,